Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to talk about the Four Kingdom classification system. Now this Four Kingdom classification system was put forward in order to overcome the disadvantages or limitations of the Two Kingdom and the Three Kingdom system of classification. So in this system of this system of classification was basically put forward because of a very important discovery, the discovery of electron microscope. Now, because of the discovery of electron microscope, the structures of various cells got revealed. So, uh, electron microscope revealed the structures of most importantly bacteria. We got to know how a bacteria look, looks like and how is it different from the other organisms. Now, bacterial cell structure was found to be different from other organisms. This was possible only because of the invention or the discovery of electron microscope. Now bacteria were called prokaryotes. What do we mean by this? Pro means primitive, karyon means nucleus. So why were they called so? Bacteria was called prokaryotes and they were included in the group of prokaryotes because they did not have a true nucleus. Whereas other organisms other than bacteria, they were known as eukaryotes because they had, they possessed true nucleus. So we got two groups, prokaryotes and eukaryotes. Now, in the year uh, 1956, a scientist named Copeland, he created a separate kingdom which is known as Kingdom Monera and this kingdom actually consisted of these bacterial cells. So based on this uh, four kingdom classification and the introduction of the fourth group, we have a four kingdom classification system. We already had Plantae, Animalia and Protista. Now we have also the Kingdom Monera. So we have got four kingdom classification. The most important or major disadvantage of the four kingdom classification system is that fungi continue to remain in case of plants which is not correct as we know. So in this video we have talked about the intervention or the coming of four kingdom classification which was put forward to uh, in order to uh, overcome the disadvantages of three kingdom classification. We have seen the introduction of a new group Monera. We have also talked about the discovery of electron microscope because of which the structures got revealed. Now we have got four kingdoms, kingdom Monera, Protista, Plantae and Animalia. I hope you have understood and enjoyed this video. Thank you.